Hey guys, it's from Ikea and I'm back with another video. As you can tell by the title, this is going to be a health slash like hygiene slash like just some of my favorite products, some things I use every day type of video. I don't really know what to call it. What am I going to put for the title? I don't know. Anyways, this, this is going to be a video, a combination video of some of the products that I use on a daily basis every day um, from skincare to personal hygiene to just everything, everything. If you're interested in what I do, some of my daily routine regimens, please stick around and don't forget to subscribe. Before we even get into this, go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to wait. And while you at it, just go ahead and hit the like button. Like, come on, help, help a sister out. Hit the like button and go ahead and subscribe. And let's get right into the video. What should I get into first? I have a variety of products right here to my left. So if I'm looking to my left, that's because I have some products there. I'm going to start with my body soap. I'm going to go from, like, hygiene to health. Health will be at the end because health is, you know, and eh, eh, nobody cares about health. Everybody cares about hygiene. So I'm going to go with what I wash my body with while I'm in the shower. And that is Dr. Bronner's Soap. Dr. Bronner's Soap is a pure castor soap. Um, I love this stuff. It's 100% organic. Um, you can use it for a variety of things. I have a million of them. This is my favorite one, which is a peppermint um, flavor. Uh, not flavor because you don't eat it, but a peppermint scent. I love, love, love this one. Um, peppermint, you know how peppermint, like when you chew gum, peppermint gum, it gives you like that cool sensation, like that cool feeling, like your mouth is just like, like cold, pretty much. So this does this with your body. So you like feel like just clean. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. When you use this, you will literally see like the dirt coming going down the drain like you will see the dirt come off your body when you use this this is an 18 in 1 hemp soap um, it could be used for many things you'll wash your hair with it you can use it as a face wash you can use it as a body wash you can use it to mop your floor you can use this for so many different things like and each different thing that you can use this for is this on a bottle that's why so many words on this bottle like they give you a million different scenarios that you could use this for this is again, this is the 18 in 1 soap. It's 100% organic, made with organic oils. You know how oils. some of those products you just be reading the ingredients and you just like, what does that do? Let me look this up. Like, all these ingredients on here, you can understand. You, like, you know what you're actually putting on your body. They're all essential oils, it's all organic. That's why I love it. I'm trying to go just all organic, period, with my just everything personal hygiene with my body wash with my deodorant with my toothpaste like with everything i use on a daily basis because trust me i be doing a lot of research y'all and if y'all look into some of that stuff that we use on a daily basis it's so toxic toxic to our bodies and we're wondering why all these people are coming out with cancer and you know like why cancer is just like oh that person has cancer that person has cancer that person has cancer this person is sick they don't know what's wrong with this person it's because we use toxic products on a daily basis and i'm really trying my hardest to switch to all organic products all just natural products if i don't understand the ingredients i'm trying not to use it on my body and also put it into my body as you can see i really use these products because they're almost gone in every bottle you see they all like at the bottom um, and this is peppermint flavor, this is hemp rose flavor, and this is hemp lavender. I use lavender in the nighttime, like when I take a shower right before bed, I'll use the lavender soap. Because lavender is a natural relaxant, it calms your body, calms your spirit and your soul. So I use that right before bed and it gets me so relaxed. The rose, it just smells good, so I use this all the time. And the peppermint, I just love the cool feeling. If you don't, let me just let y'all in on a little secret. If you don't like your hoo-ha to feel cool, don't use the peppermint because you will feel cool down there for about 10 or 15 minutes after your shower. But hey, you be clean, so yeah. <laughs> Next, uh, for my face, you can get into that skin, baby. I was really having a problem with acne at one point in time. Um, I didn't really have acne as a younger, like as a child or in high school or anything like that. It was like in my adulthood, you know? 
so right now my skincare regimen is old faithful old faithful everybody in their mother has used this before i show so you probably already know what i'm talking about cetaphil cetaphil is old faithful no matter how many products i get um face washes how many oh that's ghetto i got the little tape how much it costs on the front oh well no matter how many face washes I use, I always go back to Old Faithful because this gets your skin clean and right and fresh without it feeling hard and dry and nasty. I love Cetaphil. I swear by Cetaphil. I use Cetaphil every single day in the shower. Every single day. It's a daily face wash for me. Um, when I'm not using Cetaphil, I do not use this every day, but I do use this on a like weekly basis. And it is the Tea Tree Skin Clearing Face Wash by The Body Shop. And as you can see, it's halfway gone, so I do use this. Not every day, but maybe like every other day or every two days. I mean, every two or three days. I like this. It's cool. And tea tree oil is good for your skin. Just good for a whole lot of things. So, I like that kind of thing. When I'm washing my face, I use this little spin brush. This is not a Clarisonic. This is a little Olay. Because I can't afford the Clarisonic. So, this is like a little Olay. Little cheap brand, but hey, get the job um, done. When I have an acne pimple or like a big bump that's like inflamed and inflamed, I say inflamed. <laughs> if I have like a big pimple that's inflamed or anything, I'll use tea tree oil, a hundred percent pure tea tree oil. I love tea tree oil. I use this for many, many, many things. So if like there's a pimple, I'll like dab a tea tree oil on. Um, like a q-tip and i just dab it on my face and i'll do that maybe about two or three times per day like once when i wake up once in the middle of the day and once at night and the pimple will dry up really quick and go away you can also use tea tree oil on cold sores and nail fungus and foot fungus and so many things um and anybody who has piercings tea tree oil is a great astringent for piercings it's an essential oil and i when i first got my nose ring i used to get like a bump on the top of the nose ring like right at the hole and i just put tea tree oil on it and it cleared up um in about three to four days like the bump has been gone and never has came back right that is just one of my many essential oils i use essential oils every day and i love them um Another essential oil that I use every day is lavender oil. This is very small. It's hard to see. But lavender oil. I use lavender oil right before bed because I have terrible insomnia, y'all. Like, every night I'm up till, like, 2 and 3 in the morning. And I'll get up for work at, like, 5. So, you do the math. I need more sleep than that. So, every night before bed I use lavender oil just to calm my body and relax my body. And like I said, I use lavender soap also just to calm my body and relax it and just let me, as soon as I hit the bed, go to sleep. And I also have a bunch of other essential oils. I love essential oils. I have one for detoxing, one for sore muscles, one for stress relief, and one for relaxing. And I got this little like seven piece set. This goes inside there too. From TJ Maxx for $7.99. Essential oils can be expensive, so check TJ Maxx, like Home Goods, Marshalls, all that. All that. Are we still on face or are we going to health? Well, let's go to this kind of in half and half. Another product that I use is aloe vera. Everybody knows about the aloe vera plant and it's many, 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 many talents. This is aloe vera leaf gel and it's good for so many different things. Um, for dark, spot, dark spots on your face, like after you have a pimple, at least like that dark mark, you just put aloe vera gel on it every single day and it'll clear that mark up. Any like sores or bruises or cuts, anything, aloe vera will do the job. So I use this not every day, but whenever it's needed, I use it and I love it. And now let's go to health. Health is wealth. Like I was telling you before, I'm on a journey to just change my life, change my diet, change my way of thinking, my way of living. I'm educating myself more. I'm doing my research more on just healthy living. And for the past maybe like six months, seven months, I've been taking vitamins. These two are Ollie vitamins. This is a women's daily multivitamin. Um, I take two of these every day. Um, 
and this had this is a blend of vitamins A, B, C, D, E, biotin, and folic acid. And then this is a women's superfood multivitamin. And it's complete multivitamin plus um, a boost of super fruits and veggies. So these two are good for you to use every single day. Um, so you can get all your fruits and your veggies if you don't get them by eating them and just all your vitamins In the future I don't want to have any type of problems any bone issues no vitamin deficiencies anything like that So I'm getting my vitamins in now Missed out on a couple years, but I'm back And I don't always use Ollie I just got Ollie because it was cute and it was on sale at the Target the other day when I went but before I got this Ollie brand I just used plain old Vitafusion and I actually like Vitafusion a little bit better. It tastes better. The Ollie kind of tastes like. Would you did like when y'all was a kids? Did y'all take the Flintstone vitamins? That's kind of what the Ollie tastes like. The Flintstone and this has got like a little a little aftertaste. So if Ollie, if you watch this ever, fix that aftertaste. Vitafusion, y'all doing a good job. This tastes just like gummy bears. And you, as you can see, I use this every day because I only got about ten in the thing left. So maybe I go to Target after this video and get me some more. Another product that I. Ooh, I just spit all over. Oh my gosh. Another product I use um, on my body um, as like a lotion is virgin coconut oil. I just put a little of this in my hands, rub my hands together, and it melts down. And I just rub it all over my body, you know. Get a little oiled up. Well, it just makes my skin feel so good, so I use it As I said daily. before, I'm trying to go to natural route with my daily hygiene products like soaps, toothpaste, deodorant, etc. Um, so for deodorant, I switched from using like Dove and Secret and I don't know, all the other degree. I switched from using those brands and now I use Crystal. It look a little off brand, but it's not. Um, I got this from the Mom Organic store. Um, and so far I like this brand so far so good um, because I've tried other organic deodorants that do not include um, paraffins or fragrances this is hyperallergenic and it's no it's fragrance free and paraffin free and like I said before all the ingredients on the back you know what they are you don't gotta look them up nothing you don't got you ain't got do none of that. You know that's not toxic for your body. And I feel like things that I use on a daily basis should not be toxic on my body because after a long period of time, I know that those toxins have absorbed into my skin and uh, 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 uh. so yeah, I use crystal. You can get it from any organic store, I'm sure. Um, I've tried the brand Tom's. Let me see if I can find it. I don't know where it's at, but I tried the organic deodorant brand Tom's, and let me tell you, child. Yeah, your girl was funky than a monkey outside because that Tom's wore off in like an hour. Like literally, it wore off. So, so far the crystal's doing good. That's the only organic, like non-paraffin, non-toxic deodorant that I found that actually lasts, you know, for a while. I'm telling you guys, look into the products that you're using on your body on a daily basis. Look at some of the ingredients on those bottles and search some of the ingredients and tell me what you find. Comment below if whatever when you find out what you find. Some of those ingredients say cancer causing, um, can be toxic if used daily. Like they all have those things up there. So just look into what you're using on your body, guys. All I'm gonna say is look into what you're using on your body, look into what you're putting inside your body, and just be educated on the products that you use, guys. Don't use it just because I referred it. Don't use it just because somebody else referred it. Do what works best for you. Do your own research. And that's what you're gonna learn on my channel. Do your own research. One week I might like something, and next week I might not because I learned something different about it. So, look it up. See you guys later.